It's for my new chick, try and get fit. Say she too thick. Ain't no such thing as too thick. What you wanna be a too big? <laughs> Hi loves, welcome back to the channel. So I'm bringing you a Fashion Nova haul. You guys know I love Fashion Nova. Um, I basically have everything in a 3X, I believe. And um, for the shoes, I have everything in an 8.5 or a 9. This first outfit is from Fashion Nova, but you'll see that in a live portion. Um, this hair, I'll be doing a whole video on six color units. So you will have that information then. I'm trying them out and reviewing them right now. So yeah, I'm in between that. So let me show you, oh, if you want to shop with Fashion Nova and you want some money off of your order, I do have a discount code. It's XO Daquana, and I believe my Daquana XO one still works, but to be safe, it's XO Daquana. I'll leave it on the screen, and you can save some coins on your order. Um, what else did I want to mention? I think that's pretty much it. Let me go ahead and show you guys the shoes. So this first shoe, I don't know, it's just super duper plus size for me in my opinion. Um, super duper everyday wear. This is a pretty, like such a pretty orange. I don't have any orange heels, so this is something that I need, especially for the summer. But it's a very vivid orange, and it's a very low chunky heel, which is definitely good for me, <laughs> being a non, I guess, heel wearer. But this is a very good heel for me because I don't wear heels on a daily basis and this looks very comfortable. It's just a simple heel, short, chunky, and that's what it looks like. So this one I've been wanting forever. I've been looking for a rose gold heel that I can actually wear, but I really wanted it for my shelf as well because, you know, my shelf is in the office and my office pop color is like rose gold, so... I've been looking for some rose gold heels and this one is similar to the orange, probably the exact same shoe, both size nine and yes, yeah, just rose gold, chunky heel again and super low, so super doable for me and yeah, I've just been looking for rose gold and I'm so happy to have found it. Um, a lot of the places I went on, my size kept getting sold out very quickly, so shout out to Fashion Nova for having my size and the exact style that I wanted. I have something on there. So that's that. So this next shoe is, I don't even know the style of it, but it's so cute to me. I'm um, also size nine, looks just like that. Low heel, not as chunky as the first pair, but um, well, the first and second pair, but it's still very doable. I don't know how it's gonna be without the back support because that's what I'm used to. I don't really like a heel flopping off of me but we'll see um just looks like that i don't really know what to call this color but it's like looks like yellow with like a dab of green in it or something like that and maybe a dab of brown not really sure but that's what that looks like i am so in love with these i think people call them mules mules moves moles i'm gonna say mules <laughs> Um, I was going to call them a clog. I don't know why, but definitely a mule, if that's how you pronounce it. Um, I have a similar pair, but they're, and it's from Fashion Nova, but they have like a checkered plaid type of black, white detail on it. I'm super duper comfortable, and I just wanted this color because apparently this is my color. When I post stuff in this color on Instagram, it gets so much love, so... This right here, <laughs> Mustard Golden, is it. Um, and I love the little bow. And yeah, it's just a comfortable, cute, casual shoe. So that's that right there. Lastly, I have these bad boys. I did not know they would be so high. Um, these are very high for me. And then they don't look like they have too much support around the ankle um, in the front. So I don't really know how these are going to work. But I love that strappy detail right there. Nice little dainty strap across the foot. Um, yeah, wow. 
I didn't know they were this high, but they are cute as hell. I'll say that. So let's go ahead and get into the clothing portion. It will be live-ish. So let's go ahead and get into the clothing try-on portion. It will be live style, or I guess that's a term for it. So this is the first set. Absolutely love it, but however, it's too low in the back, so I won't be keeping it um, because I'm not here for struggle outfits. That's going to be a, ha a hassle to wear. So, um, love this. You guys know it looks like a popular brand because of the colors. Um, love the navy white. I mean, the red just looks really good breaking that up. A red heel would be really cute with this. But as you can see, definitely comes down too low. I don't want to flash you guys anything, so gonna cover that up I just saw the front and was in love so that's this first outfit right here of course I'll be back with the next so we can start off with the fact that it's too short in the back but I want to talk about what I love about it so oh let me show you how I styled it I really saw this on the site and was like that would be so cute I feel like some type of I don't know daddy teacher or something I don't know anywho um yeah, I paired it with the shoes I showed you guys earlier, the mules, and then, yeah, I just love this set. I've seen it so many times on Insta, and I was like, oh my gosh, let me go ahead and get my hand on it, because, on well, my hands, because it's just so cute. Um, but yeah, definitely, if I was to ever wear this, black, I think this is black in here, or navy, tights and some boots or something, because way 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 too high too short in the back but i don't even see me you know wearing this but i thought it was so cute it looks really really pretty so oh my gosh i'm looking over here in the viewfinder it looks so cute it looks so cute so that's this one right here i mean i think it looks really pretty with this blue hair too so just a little nice touch but that's this one i love it it's like the skirt is so short, but then you have long sleeves, so it doesn't know if it wants to be classy or thotty. So, anywho, oh, and it's like a square ish. It's kind of squarish at the neckline. Okay, so this one, I forgot the name of it, but I love this dress right here. It's really pretty. But my favorite part about it, again, is how the red just breaks it up. The red and the white kind of breaks it up. And I love the sleeves because I love a long sleeve, and y'all know. I love sleeves so so yeah I really like this I like the two white stripes it's just really cute I guess it's like that sporty chic that um, a lot of companies are doing now very trendy um I definitely see this as a fall outfit with the over the knee boots and yeah so let me show you guys back so it doesn't ride up too bad back there it's just fully black on the back and yeah so I really like this one I'm glad I chose it this could also work with a red over the knee boot or a red heel or a black heel. And I'm kind of warm. I don't know if it's the dress or the boots, but. <laughs> okay, so now we have this set. It's so funny because I have it in black already. I think I have it over there in gray. But this is like the nude version and it's long. I love this one so much better than the, um, the gray one and the black one just because it's a longer skirt. Those are like really short and then they're like super duper thin. So, yeah. Let me show you the back. Um, and oh, you know, I don't know if you guys can see, but I paired it with the orange heel that I showed you earlier. And I wanted to pair it with this kimono, which I thought was really pretty. And yeah, so something like that. Um, it has an orange in it, but the kimono has like a darker orange. Like it's more muted than the orange in the shoe, but I still think it's a pretty touch. I love this. Um, let me put it all the way on. All right. So it has a bunch of room in the sleeves and my hair is aggravating me. But yeah, honestly, for this type of outfit, I would probably just drape it off the shoulder or something like that and yeah I just thought this was so pretty I love the print and I love the color of the kimono and so that's this right here I'm about to take a picture for it yeah I think this is so pretty 
Okay, so now we have this one, and I think it's the heart size skirt set. I thought it was the no manners, but I could be mistaken. I think the tan one could have been the no manners, and this one could have been the heart side. Who knows? So, um, yeah, like I said, I got this in black already, so I already was familiar with the material. I already knew it was thin, but that's the point of the kimono um, because it is shorter for one, and it is thin. So, yeah, um, you can definitely get you some length with the kimono um i don't know which one i like better i like that this one has side slits i think that's really cute let me put it all the way on so this is what it look looks like all the way on um i like it hanging off but i just want to show y'all so then when i turn around i'll show you the length so like I said, it's definitely shorter and not my style. So I would um put this on. Still showing skin in the front, you still like covered up in the back. So it's just the perfect little match. Um, I didn't feel like putting on heels, so I honestly just put on a pair of white sandals. If y'all can see, um. That's all I did with that. And this is, I guess it does have a true white in it, but it also has like beige and ivory. So I guess a pair of white or um, beige or gray sandals will go or silver. So so that's this outfit, one of my favorites. So I like this one. I like the last one. Love the plaid one. I love the dress. Um, What didn't I like? Oh, the first one, it was really cute, but it didn't fit right. But um. On to the next. Y'all, this one is a winner. Like, I've been telling myself, okay, if you're adding stuff to your closet, take some out. But it's like, every single thing so far, I need to keep. Except for the first set and the plaid set. Those are iffy. But this for sure, y'all. Look. So the dress is like, uber stretchy. Um, I like the way the stripes are done. How they go diagonal up here and then up and down or vertical at the bottom i think it's done really nice it's really pretty on the model it was actually shorter but but i like the length of it on me paired it with some yellow shoes because it brought out the yellow stripes now i was going to do either a red shoe a black shoe or a, um what was the other one? Oh, this blue one right here so red blue black or yellow so i decided to go with yellow because i thought it was more of a statement um, and it just looks really pretty. So let me show you the back. Anyways, this is what the back looks like. It's really plain and simple as far as design. As far as the design or style of the dress. But the pattern is what really brings it to life. Um, I did take my bra off for this one just because of the spaghetti strap. And I wanted to have a cute picture. <laughs> so um, this is what it looks like without a bra. Um, you do have some food pie area going on down here, but it is what it is. Um, yeah, support is not so much like these are dainty, but I think it works because the stripes kind of distract and you don't really know where your boob is a little bit. And I know my wig is looking crazy right about now, but the synthetic hair, I can't get with it anymore unless it's shorter. So, um, yeah, so this side is like a winner over here. But then I feel like really exposed on this side. I don't feel like I have enough support. Um, I just, I took my bra off for this one too. So I just would want it to be um, a little better supported over here. But I think the whole design of it is really cute. I kind of just wish, if it wasn't going to be a ruffle over there, that it would be like a thicker strap. Because this spaghetti strap, again, just doesn't hold me in. But I mean, it's not the worst looking thing I've seen. I really like this thing. I know I live for some red. So, yeah, this is really cute. Um, let me show you guys the back. The back is actually done really nicely. So, that's the back. It's done really nicely. The ruffle kind of goes across and meets on the other side. And then it's like a kind of a deep V, but not really. And, yeah, I really like the back of it. These short heels would do. 
um, to give me a little more height. I know a lot of people ask, do I get my clothes tailored? I don't. <laughs> I feel like if it doesn't fit um, how I want, then I just put it in a cell or give it away um, or let it drag. But, um, yeah, this wouldn't be too bad with a really low heel. That rose gold one, like that type of height, that would be really good. Um, so, yeah, that's this one right here, the material. And, y'all, I don't even think you would need a Spanx with this. Like, I feel like it does something... Like it's built in shape real low key. Like you do see a little imprint of the stomach, but other than that, it looks really good. So that's this right here. It's a really thick, stretchy material. And I'm really feeling this one. But I just feel whew, droopy over here. <laughs> so this is the outfit that you show up to your ex funeral in, like girl, and then leave with his daddy. It's like no, <laughs> I'm just playing. So, um, I love this. Um the pearls, I actually can feel it through the little um, what do you call this? Is this really a kimono, cardigan, shawl, whatever you want to call it, um, duster. I can feel like the pearls, they kind of, not cold, but I just feel them. So, anywho, this is so pretty. I think I saw someone wear it as a cover-up for the beach. It does come with a belt. Um, I didn't really like it tied, so I'll probably just take the belt out or just tie it in the back or something. But I absolutely love this little, um duster right here and then it makes little noises when you rub across it so then this top is also from do you really call this a top or like a bralette is also from fashion nova i like that it has adjustable straps um it really saved me because honey i was like who down here <laughs> i was all the way down here before i adjusted the straps and um But yeah, and then you can tie it right here to pull your boobs a little closer together. It does have like a little peep hole and then it's all lacy and see-through down here. And these are just the super high-waisted skinny from Fashion Nova. I swear by these. I have them in probably every color or have them in every color. But the black are always my favorite. The black and the navy or indigo. I wear those all the time. Um, these are the stretchiest pair, I believe. Besides the canopy and um, the new pair I hauled in the last haul. These are like one of the stretchiest pairs and a lot of people ask, well, which jeans do you get? Because every time I get jeans, they don't fit. Um, check out the material because if it's 98% cotton and 2% spandex, it's not really going to work if you have hips, butt, stomach, thighs, and all of that. But for me, um, if it's like, if it has, you know, different materials that I know stretch, those are the ones I go for. But yeah, that's this outfit right here. I just thought it was so cute and it's dark, but it's pretty. And I was going to pair these with those black heels, but I just was like, woo, I don't know. They're a little bit high for me. So um, this is the outfit part of it. So this is the back. My wig is inside there. So yeah. And I'm going to come up so you can see the bralette a little better but that's what it looks like I really love this and um I have so many black bralettes but I don't know I just keep adding to the collection this is one of my favorites because this part is not see-through I have one that I have from last year or the year before that and it's see-through so you can see the nets and stuff which you really can't see them but you can see them um but I like that this is covered and then it's just sheer down here and you can tie it right here. So yeah, this is one of my favorite bralettes ever. So, Can I change my mind? I think this is the one you wear to the funeral, y'all. This is the one you wear to your ex's funeral. This is it. It's like, nah. <laughs> I think this is actually a swimsuit cover-up, if I'm not mistaken. Um, if I was to wear this as an actual dress, I would put like a whole either tube top and actual skirt under here. Or like a um, just like a tube dress, a mini one. Um, or like I said, I think this is a swimsuit cover up, but I just put on some black underwear and I kept that black bralette on. I know some people wear this out. I know some people wear stuff like this on their birthday, but I'm just telling you what I would do with it. And yeah, I think they had like a neon green or pink or yellow. They had a bright color of this and I thought it was really cute, but I was like, let me go ahead and get the black. I think this is so cute, y'all. So let me show you the back which is just see-through. So that's what the back is looking like. Kind of got to fix it up here. And 
So yeah, that's it. Thank you all so much for bearing with me. I honestly think when I edit this video, I'm going to go back and be like, girl, you act like you talk so much and you it was so long. But tonight was just so long because I've been filming six, seven, since 7. It's like almost 2 now. So yeah, I filmed a lot today, y'all. Oh, and one last thing. I love the material of this. It's like a, almost like a ruffled rusion. I don't really know how to explain it, but it's just so nice. Um, and like I said, I think this is a cute swimsuit cover-up or like a tube dress cover-up. But yeah, that's that. So again, thank you for joining. I hope you enjoyed also, don't forget to use my coupon code XOTheQuana if you want to save some coins. Um, I'll leave all the links to the items that are still available down below. All sizes are probably a 3X. Um, and like I said, the shoes are probably a 9 or 8.5. I'll leave all that on the screen though. Um, yeah, I think I'm not forgetting anything. This hair review, all these wig reviews, the colored ones will be combined into one video. And I think that's it. Thank you guys for joining.